Hi, welcome to Too Smart, where we're getting our day and our week off to a great start. And I'm in a different space today, and I'll show you a bit more about that in a minute. But I want to go back to where we ended last week, which was just that whole piece of just for today, and where I was sensing that um, overwhelm and actually being worried about something that was 10 days out. And for me, when I went into that space of just for today, made the video, shared the video, did my newsletter and everything. That evening, completely unrelated, as in the person who messaged me had no clue that I'd shared all that. A friend of mine showed up with the complete and perfect solution to what I was worried about. And it was all sorted in a matter of minutes. Um, and that leads me into what's going on right now. So when I woke up this morning, my first thought was, oh my God, wonderful this time next week that's all going to be finished and that that is the Dublin mind body spirit experience which was what one of the things that was overwhelming me last week because it was also something else very big on my plate at the time which has now been postponed um which has also helped but what I realized is that um you know when we can get into that space also not just in advance giving ourselves a space and feeling this is going to work itself out. But also feeling, oh my God, you know, as when my kids used to do horse riding, it was like see past the jump. But what I'm inviting you to do is feel past the jump, feel the relief that it's over. And then as I sat with that, with my pot of coffee this morning, what I was thinking is, well, in my mind, you know, I'm building a lovely picture of how Dublin Mind Body is going to be that you know i'll have prepared the right talk i know it's called recipe for success i'm kind of channeling it in at the moment and so, you know, on on saturday and sunday um but also that i have connected with the right people that you know i will have shared the right cards with people because i'm going to be doing pick a card with, with everybody and whoever is needs my books and my cards will have bought them etc and that i will be helping people to connect with their magic which is my journey and so I've been creating this lovely vision of how I'm going to wake up next Monday morning feeling, oh my God, that was amazing. Um, what unfolded was beyond my wildest dreams and I'm just so happy. And then I had this huge urge that I needed to go into a different space. And I suppose the thing about it is, right, this once was my fabulous classroom and uh, the floor collapsed, as many people know, and it has never, I just haven't been able to get it fixed yet. Um, and so my, the books and things for the RDS are actually all down here now. Um, but what's coming in really strongly is that whole piece of feeling the relief. So what I decided to do this morning was to actually start to feel the relief that this room is fixed. Uh, because while part of me wants to leave and move to Cyprus, the other part of me is like, I love living where I live. I love my home. I love the neighborhood. I love the community. And part of me doesn't want to go um and so yeah and it's that's not an, always an easy path when you're pulled between different things um but what's really coming in strongly to share is that you know this is a feeling universe and for as long as i'm looking at this space and i'm feeling it's still not done things are never coming right for me i bust my ass and things never go right i am sending all those vibes out there and what I'm attracting back is exactly more of that and I stay stuck. So today I decided that I was going to feel the relief of this room is fixed. I now am running all my wonderful classes from my classroom again. Um, you know, I'm doing what I'm meant to be doing and I know given what I saw happen last week with the friend to show up with the solution, once I move into that space of relief, but then I'm actually opening my energy up for the universe to provide the way forward for this to be sorted. And that's why I'm down here. Because as you can see, like the stones are still on the ground. Um, and anyway, it is as it is. Do you know what? I know what a fabulous space this is. And I know it's been a transformational space for many people, especially for myself. So that's what I wanted to share for today. Um, I hope it makes sense. It's what's coming in and I know more and more that's what I've got to do is no matter how mad what's coming in is I need to share it because whoa I'm getting all hot now even saying that that's what I'm here to do I'm here to share the wisdom that's coming through me and it will connect with whoever I'm meant to connect with so I'm going to pull a card as usual uh, I probably have to put my glasses on now <laughs> 
So today is the perfect new start. And the other card is I'm exactly where I'm meant to be, which, oh, sorry. It looks like I'm exactly where I'm meant to be card, but it's I expect the best and that's what I get. And so it is about our expectations. Um, but I also feel I'm exactly where I'm meant to be and it's a bit annoying. So, you know, if you're in discomfort, it's there for a reason. And uh, once we actually understand what the reason is and get the lesson, that's usually when we get out, it's a bit like Jumanji, isn't it? We, we're allowed to move on. So I'm gonna expect the best. I'm gonna expect to have an amazing time at the Dublin Mind Body Fair. If anybody's in Dublin, uh, Friday to Sunday, I'm on stand 100. I'm giving two talks on Saturday and Sunday. I'd love to see you. Um, and look, whatever's going on for you, be gentle with yourself. Do, if you have the time, even take five minutes a day just to set your intention to have an amazing day. The instructions will be below here and also your daily gratitude practice. Even a couple of things to be grateful for just leaves you in a better space. Um, so send in all my love and look forward to seeing you in another video again soon. There is not going to be a video next week because I've decided I'm going to be working all weekend and I'll be pushing myself too hard and that's a lesson I have to learn as well. Sometimes you need to have a rest. So I'll be back on Monday week and until then have a great time. Bye.